three, two, one, go! And we're off with our first match of the day on field number one in Edison Division. All four robots in motion in autonomous mode. All right, we have ball spilled all over. We do have one scored. Blue bowling ball, good job by the Blue Lions. Red Alliance, Robot also in their safe zone with two seconds left in autonomous mode. And that is the end of autonomous mode. All right, looks like we're about ready to go. Referees are still scoring down here on field number one. All right, referees, we're good. Okay, drivers, you have your controllers. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. And we're off in tele-operated mode on field number one here. With a Red Alliance on the right side of the field. Looks like the two partners are trying to collect some balls. Clambering through the bins, making their way. Picking up as many as they can, scoring the highest they can. Flipping a bin now. 38-24, the third. Our team from India. Looks like they have a nice little effective claw device to try and flip those bins over. Phenetrix trying to make their way over to their bins with a really nice claw gripping mechanism on their robot. Fear the gear for the Blue Alliance, their Alliance partner. Also picking up balls, positioning themselves for a bin pickup. And their Alliance partner, once again for the Blue Alliance, 3509. Now with two bins in their possession. Both up right now. For the Red Alliance, team one. That's Team Unlimited. The oldest team in the FTC program. 34 seconds now left in this match, and we're coming up on endgame, and here we go. That is endgame for the Blue Alliance. 35-67, fear the gear. Trying to get a bin up. Their lifting mechanism, their scissor lift is now bending over under the weight of this bin. Looks like they're a little bit trapped on the sidewall with 13 seconds left in this match. Both Red Alliance robots. Not in motion at this point. Let's see if they got anything left in them with five, four, three, two, one. That's the end of our first match, field number one. All right, everyone, we're on Edison number two, and let's welcome on the Red Alliance, team number 2879. That's team 2879, the Thunderbots from Heritage Christian High School, Bozeman, Montana, winning alliance in the Montana Championship. All right, we got the scores for match number one on Edison. There you have it, Blue wins, 41 to 11. Great job in match number one. Three, two, one, go! Sorry. Three of the four robots now in motion into autonomous mode. 
Team 2845 has already flipped the bin in autonomous, making their way over. They just made their way into the front end zone for a score. Nice to be done by the Blue Lions with six seconds left in autonomous mode. Team 2879 robot doing the dance for the Red Alliance. Nice. Referee scoring this match. All right, drivers, grab your controllers. Drivers, grab your controllers. Referee's good. Referee's good. All right, Red Alliance ready, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. All right, all four robots in motion. 45-39, the sourdoughs for the Red Alliance. It's like they're trying to position a bin stack with balls. Trying to keep possession of it without knocking them over. They've got to work their way through a mass of bins and balls in the center of the field. For the Blue Alliance, 33-60, Team Caffeine. It's like they're also trying to position for flipping bins over. 28-45 down here is already starting a little bit of a scissor lift for the Blue Alliance. That's team duct tape, and they've done it. They're able to flip over bin, working their way to a second bin. But now we're still waiting to see some balls go into these bins. All of these robots have incredible capability. That's why they are here today. Up on the ramp, team 45-39 for the Red Alliance with 34 seconds left in this match. Already starting their bin lift. Good safe zone for them. And there they go with 29 seconds. Single ball in the bin. Lifting higher and higher for the Red Alliance. Beautiful job by the Sourdoughs. Their Alliance partner also in possession of the bin with 14 seconds left. Let's see if they can get it up for the Red Alliance. And there they go. There they go, the Thunderbots. We've got five, four, three, two, one. Wow, that's the highest lift of the day. I think we're going to see a lot higher than that, but we will see. That's awesome. What do you think, Dave? All right, over on Edison, let's do the score for match number two. It's up on the big screen. Woo! Look at the score for match number two, 144 points goes to the red. 15 points to the blue. Three, two, one, go! All right, we got our robots in motion. And on autonomous mode, nicely done by team. For our blue lions, that's the Roa Patriots. Both a robot and a bowling ball with 10 seconds left. And Red Alliance as well in the front zone, Red Alliance in the rear zone. We got a lot of scoring down here in autonomous mode. All right, looks like these guys are gonna rock the house. Let's wa see what they can do. So the blue team, yeah. they push the two, two stacks by this way. But they're out of the center, so it shouldn't impact our autonomous. I'm not gonna play them. These are, these are our alliance, these are our opponents. All right, drivers, you all have your controllers. Time's on the board, ready for teleop mode. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. 
And they're up and running, match number three here on Edison Field. Every team here for the next few days, every team gets eight matches, eight matches. We know in qualification and state tournaments around the United States, we usually do five, but we're getting in as many as we can for these teams. They've earned their way to the world championship. They're going to get a lot of play time. We're going to see some incredible robotics over the next couple days. We got Ben scattered all over the floor. Many of them are in upright position, just waiting to be loaded up with balls, waiting to be lifted as high as they possibly can be. FTA checking the robot out for the Blue Alliance on the field. And for the Red Alliance, it's like they're battling for a bin with Blue Alliance. We still have 43 seconds left in this match. And we're in end game. Let's see what they have for us for the Blue Lions, or excuse me, for the Red Alliance. I like robotics from Haymarket. They do have a bin. Let's see if they have a lift in mind. And it looks like they do. I'm seeing a little nudge upward with 10 seconds left in this match. And their Alliance partner now doing a lift. Antipodes, nicely done. Both Red Alliances right with the last second to go. Successfully lifting those bins with a ball. And a nice job by the Red Alliance. Match number three. All right, there you have it. Red wins match number three. 205 points and a hard-earned 20 by the Blue Alliance. Good job to those two teams. Three, two, one, go. Autonomous mode. Two to four robots in motion, one for each alliance. And Team 47, 47, able to get a blue bowling ball in the front zone for a score, nice. 10 seconds left down, Autonomous. And that is the end of Autonomous mode. All right, drivers, grab your controllers. Drivers, grab your controllers. Okay, everything looks good. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. All right, all robots now in motion. Our team 458 activate go initiative now making the way down the ramp. Tumbling balls all across the floor. Balls all over the floor mean lots of scoring opportunities. Looks like we have two robots, three robots with scissor lift, scissor lift mechanisms and one robot with a crane lift mechanism. Love to see them put into action. One minute, 20 seconds left in this match. All right, for the Blue Alliance, trying to get a grasp on one of the blue team, blue bins is Team 458.
4106 doing a dance. Let's see what strategy they have up their sleeve, that supposable thumb. Looks like we've lost the track. We did lose one tread in the middle of the field. 30 seconds now, we're going to the end game. And coming up on 15 seconds to go. That's good. Yeah. And we have a lift, unfortunately no bin, but we have a lift. Showing their stuff with one second left for the Red Alliance. That's team 3141. All right, okay. And there you have it, blue wins, 48 to nothing. Great job to the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Robots in motion. Both red and blue eyes battling it out for a position in our front score zone in autonomous mode. It looks like we do have both spots scoring and we do have a red bowling ball. 10 seconds now left in this match. Referees doing a little bit of cleanup activity. One of the bins did spill out onto the floor. We're getting the ball back into the field. As well as a container. Drivers have their controllers. The playing field looks good. Time's on the board. Red Alliance ready. Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. Oh, good. Sir. All right, now they're off on running on the field with all four robots spinning and fighting and battling and binning. For the Red Alliance, 4185, Silver Soldiers have now flipped over a bin, pulling it into their possession. They have a nice little housing on their robot. Once they get hold of a bin, they're able to just feed balls right in as they pick them up off the floor. So the blue lines on parallel processing. Nice looking robot they have down here. All these robots are gorgeous. Great looking apparatus for going through these skills. As a good example, 2843 now taking possession of a bin, flipping it over, putting it up on top of their robot, spinning around, getting ready to load it with some of these racket handballs on the floor. And there they go. You can see very clearly balls loading in by 2843 by the blue LEDs on the front of their bots. We are in end game now. All of a sudden, end game. Silver Soldiers trying to capture a bowling ball in the front. But 2843 now has lifted their mechanism and they're lifting the bin up like a crane with 12 seconds left to go and they are up as high as they're gonna go great job great job by under the sun with three seconds and two and one great match that was qualification match number five okay over on the Edison field we got the scores for match number five they're up on the big screen blue wins 146 to 60 great job to the Red Alliance in match number five a lot of points for the blue. Three, two, one, go! All right. Where do these guys go? We've got a blue, ro blue robot scored already in the end, in the rear zone. Good ten points there.
They got four seconds now left in this match. All right, end of autonomous mode. Referee scoring. All right, drivers, grab your controllers. We're doing one last check by the referees. All right, drivers, have your controllers. Time's on the board. Referees look good. And red alliance ready, blue alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. All right, robots in motion. Balls all over the floor. We've only got one, one set of balls nesting on top of a bin. Looks like the blue alliance wants them over onto the carpet. Or are they going to try and capture it? Move it over to the same zone. Man. We'll hey, see what 53 oh, 41 yeah, has in mind. Love it. That was. That was Their alliance partner, 5838, from China. Flipping a bin up over the top of their robot. They're gonna go seek out another one. Give it another shot. One minute, 10 seconds left in this match. All right, for the Red Alliance. Two balls into a bin, flipping the bin over onto their back. Right, Newton's lawyers has also covered their bin with a little blanket with 40 seconds left to go in this match and we're coming up on end game. And here we go, one end game. Quickly, Blue Alliance now getting a bin up over the top of one of their robots. Trying to get into the right position with 15 seconds left to go in this match. We're looking for a lift here. We're looking for a lift with 10 seconds left to go. And five, four, three, two, one. All right, so Newton Lawyers has a bin. I believe there's two bills in that bin in their possession. They do have it, ele have it elevated on the back of their bot. We're gonna see how this one scores up. There goes the score for match number six. Edison, 33 wins it, Blue gets 10. Up next is match number seven on Edison. Three, two, one, go! One bot from each alliance making their way down the ramp. And into the fray. That's actually good for us. Though. Here's how the players. Oh, they bring the. They brought the bowling ball also. That's a great. And two seconds left now in autonomous mode. We do have a bowling ball for each alliance. They put the and the front and the field scoring zone. Nicely done. That's really good. Yep. That and that's the end of autonomous mode. Good. He put the bowling ball oh. in and then Timers, the good. To block them. I think, right? Timers, good. All right. Drivers have the controllers in their hands. Let's get ready for teleop mode. Red alliance, ready. Blue alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. And oh, yeah, this is teleop mode. Robots screaming around the floor. Team 4064, just good business. Well, that is just good business. Their robot has a tuxedo. And these gentlemen drivers and coach dressed appropriately for a formal party. You go to the world, you dress for the world. For the Blue Alliance Tiger team, have got possession of one bin. Let's see if they can get a couple of balls in that bin before they go into a lift. Scissor lift. There's, uh, there's a tuxedo. 
975 for the blue line's not in motion at this moment. See if they can get that bot up and running. Lightsaber now would have been in their possession for the Red Alliance. Nice sweeper mechanism, and there they go. Multiple ball sweep by their sweeper mechanism. They bring it over the top, dump it to the bin. That's really cool. Then they place that bin now up on the top of the ramp, putting in reserve for play further down the road. And now is the time because we're in end game. And for the Blue Lions, Tiger team now going into a lift with two bins, going higher and higher and higher. Well, they're leaning, they're leaning, but they can get it straightened out, and they do. Nicely done. That looks to be at least a seven-footer, if not higher. And we got two seconds left in this match, and that is it. Good job by the Blue Lions. Great lift by the Tiger team. We're going to be seeing a lot of that over the next two days. And there you have it, Blue wins 149 points. Three, two, one, go. T4081, Robot getting into their, into their zone there, into the blue zone. But 2803, Raptor Robotics moving a bowling ball wow. and bins. In autonomous mode, ball scored, bowling ball scored. Let's see if they can get the robot. Oh, and they just moved and just bumped over the balls and spilled them out as their robot was turning and getting into position. They'll have to fine tune that a little bit. All right, drivers, grab your controllers. Drivers, grab your controllers. These guys didn't do anything. All right, everything looks good. Red Alliance ready, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go! Oh, and then down to 28.59. Team Tiki coming down off the ramp, ramming into their, their partner. No damage, however, they're both still in motion. Defense down on the ground now. We got 28.03, Raptor Robotics. Now working their way over to flip some bins over, get possession of balls, let's see what they can do with their little grip and claw mechanism. They have a scissor lift tightly compacted into their 18 by 18 cube. We'll see how high they can go with that. Our Albuquerque school, the Ravens, also trying to get a bin flipped over. One minute now left in this match. Quietly at work are the droids. Now the bin in the position. Oh, just dropping it as they were trying to get around their Red Alliance. Going back for it. See if they can get it back in their possession. We got 40 seconds left in this match. Raptor Robotics, 2803 for the Red Alliance. Hasn't been in their possession. Looks like they're getting for the ready for the lift. And we, now, we are now in endgame. And there they go. There goes Raptor Robotics. Going higher and higher. Look at that lift mechanism. Very robust. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Nice. Ten seconds now left in this match. See what the other three bots have in store for us. Oh, the other one's listed a crate. Oh, Their alliance partner, 51, 32 oh, yeah. Ravens, now putting a bin on top of the robot in the last split second of this match. Nice job by the Red Alliance. A great score. And there you have it. Red wins that one. 238 points. Great job to the Red Alliance. Hard work by the blue side. Three, two, one, go. And our autonomous jumping off of the ramp oh, that's a, uh, is Mini Mash. <laughs> and here comes your alliance partner for the Red Alliance. 
making their way down as Robo Chicken Gator flies up Papaya Land. All right, robots are finished now with autonomous mode over. All right, drivers, all have your controllers. Time's on the board. Red Alliance ready. Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. And they're off. Blue Alliance immediately picking up bins, getting them in possession. We have two bins and a stack of balls now moving over to your scoring zone by 41 33. Oh, my goodness, that was great. Helena Robotics. A little bit of a nudge. Oh, and they just knocked it over in their turn. Oh, they had a great score going there. They're going to make it up. I know it. These guys are great. They flipped it over. Picking it up. For the Red Alliance, the Robo Chicken. They've already got a bit in their possession. Lifted high with a ball in it. Looks like they're sweeping up more balls and can take a a possession of another ball. Uh, four, two, three, eight is, uh, got a great. Blue Team 41-33 for the Blue Alliance. Helena Robotics now oh, looking they, to they stack bins, up. and they do. They have two bins with one ball in each of the bins. Now stacked neatly in their safe zone. 48 seconds left in this match. And Mini Mash with 30 seconds left. Motionless on the field, talking it over with our FTAs. However, their Alliance partner, 4238, does have a bin lifted. 4133 now for the Blue Alliance. Helena Robotics with their two bins. Coming up on 10 seconds left for the Blue Alliance. Team 135. There they go. Fusion with a lift. Helena Robotics with a lift. And 4238 with timeout also lifting your bin higher with a crane mechanism. Nicely done. See how this one scores up. All right, we have the scores for match number nine on Edison. And there you have it up on the big screen. Edison match number nine, 174 wins it for the Red Alliance. 80 points for Blue. Great job to those teams. Three, two, one, go. All right, we have all four robots in motion in match number 10 here on field number two. 45-54, the Robo Mustangs. Looks like they've made their way into the front zone for a score with a robot. Meanwhile, in the back zone of the field, team 230 for the Red Alliance. Good job by Ampere also scoring with a robot. We've got points on the board at the end of oh, our autonomous see, mode. Let's see what we're going to do now. And tell you up. Are all perfectly positioned for somebody to go blue. take it for the blue. Yeah. So they push the all right, drivers, you have your controllers. The corner there. Yeah. 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 If anybody can go get that now. The blues are in a great position. So even though red pushed it over there, you know, you muck things up. It's setting them up. Yeah, it is setting it up. If they were opposing us, it would have been perfect. Yeah. For us. Yeah, for us. Referees down here on field, on field number yeah, two being very precise, very fair. These referees are all seasoned ref. They know what they're doing. They all right, their way here just as our We're team ready has. for teleop mode. Okay, we're good. Red Alliance ready, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. 
Whoa! Surging down the ramp. We got a little flip over for the Blue Lions. Brainport able to right themselves oh, they're, they're, they're and get back in the action. Blocked that stack. Yeah, yeah, that's good. They completely blocked that whole stack, which is good. You can do that. All right. Robots are piling up out in the front of the field here. Are you ready? Now they're getting clear of each other. Ampere dancing around on top of these balls on the field. Great drive mechanism. They're not stopped by anything. One minute left in this match. Pretty good. A lot of defense. 230? Yeah, a lot of defense by 230. Yeah. 40 seconds, 47 seconds left in this match. The other guys got one, though. They got a blue. The blue's got one. For the Blue Lions, Brainport now has a bin on top of their robot. They do have a scissorless mechanism. There is a ball in there. End game. These guys are still together, crazy. Yeah. The Blues have got one. It's taking forever. And there they go. 20 seconds left in this match. Rainport exploding with that bin. Going high. We got seven seconds now left. Oh, and this went to motion and lost their bid. Too bad for Brainport, the Blue Lions. We are now out of time. They were trying to get into the home zone, but they stack up. There you have it on the Edison board, match number 10. There's the score. Not a lot of points, but Red Alliance wins it 15 to 8. 3, 2, 1, go. And there they go in autonomous. Only one robot down off the ramp. Oh, dead. No, still going. They're trying to do something. One robot in motion, Whitefield Academy. Their robot and their team name are the RoboCats. End of autonomous period. All right, everything's good to go. Red Alliance ready, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go! All right, wait, let's do a time. We gotta make sure we're all in check. Are you good? All right, Red Alliance ready, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go! All right, RoboCats, Team 44-44. Oh, they were trying to s oh, wiggle their bins happen. over to this get them over their scoring yeah, zone, but yeah. ended up spilling them out. It over. Doesn't seem to upset them. They got a possession of one bin already flipping it over onto the back of their robot. They have a claw to pick up the ball. But they, they, didn't, they missed it. No, he got it. Right, Red Alliance. Supper and Cyborgs have a bin in their possession. Not a ball in it yet, but there they go. They've now dropped the ball into the bin. Looks like they've got a firm grip on it as well. Nice gripper mechanism by Supper and Cyborg. For the Blue Lions. The Robots, Team 5687, now also have a bin nested onto the back of their robot. And a ball as well. 45 seconds left in this match. And we are lifting higher and higher. Suffering Cyborgs. Oh, they dropped their bin with 33 seconds left. 
Let's see if they can get it back to their possession. They still have a little bit of time, although we are in end game. And from Whitefield Academy, the RoboCats are lifting high. And 56-87 also with a beautiful lift, as they sit on their blue ramp. That's about as high as they can go, but that's probably high enough when you take in consideration their partner also has a lift. Nine seconds now left in autonomous mode. Going higher with five, four, three, two, one. How about them RoboCats? How about that Blue Alliance? Wow, what a great match. And there you have it, 538 points on Edison. Match number 11, two points to the Red Alliance. That is a high score of the day. Three, two, one, go. Robo Mounties from Canada, from Lacombe. Now on the floor for the Blue Alliance, as is their Alliance partner going into motion, are the Tesla Flyers. <laughs> Spinning around, beware of attack moose. Our team from Canada, the Robo Mounties. Doing a dance. And the autonomous. All right, drivers, grab your controllers. Drivers, grab your controllers. Okay, referees give a thumbs up, times give a thumbs up. This is teleop mode. Red Alliance ready, three, Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. Robots in motion. David, David, we have four countries represented, four different countries represented on the field here right now. Minute 30 seconds to go. Battling it out are three of the robots towards the back of the field. Trying to get possession of bins. Looks like the Robo Mounties haven't been now in their possession. For the Blue Alliance. Tesla Flyers now trying to get a hold of a bin, their Alliance partner. FTC equals mass to the power of fun, 5784, Sydney, Australia. In the back of the field, it's like they're hung up maybe on a ball, but they're moving forward, picking them up. 45 seconds now left in this match for the Red Alliance. X-Robot now starting their lift. And we're coming in the end game. There we go. Three, two, one, end game. Tesla Flyers with a bin and a ball in their possession. Whipped it off the floor, whoops, tipping forward a little bit. Have now righted themselves with 12 seconds left. Their line's partner up on the ramp, getting that bin as high as they can with five, four, Three, two, one. Hey, Eric. Nice. Red Alliance, 58, 35, 32, the X-Robot. Looks like they are at least eight feet high, if not higher. Great lift by that robot. Good job by the Red Alliance. Match number 12 is up on the big screen. 153 points to the Red Alliance. 107 to the blue. That's, I think, the highest scoring uh, Two, both teams getting in triple digits. Three, two, one, go! Good start by three of these robots. For the blue lines, we have a robot in the front zone and a robot in the, in the zone in the back of the field. Blue Alliance, nice job by both robots. Three seconds left in autonomous mode. We also have a bowling ball in our front score zone.
All right, drivers, you have your controllers. Referees, give a thumbs up. Time's on the board. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. Wow. All four robots on like a rocket ship. Wow, they're well positioned. They got two crates right there. They don't have any balls in them. No, they don't. Uh, they flip it over. They're taking time flipping it over. They haven't flipped it yet. No, they're taking a lot of time flipping it over. And they don't have a ball. Vector Robotics. Interesting drive mechanism. They've got tractors just like a tank. However, it drives wheels and also drives multiple mechanisms on the robot. Very innovative. Nice design. All right, I think they got their second grade. They got one. Junkyard Dogs, 4906 for the Red Alliance. Low slung robot. Hey, guys. Hey. Capability to pick up multiple balls. So the only team we've seen so far is turn the them over team. and load into they, their uh, bin. 4997 the uh, went to the back straight off. Has the multiple bins now in their possession for the Red they, Alliance. They just failed. They tried multiple times to get a crate and couldn't get one up. That's about it. So uh, we've not seen what the heck. So yeah, I know they might be good. I think they will be good. All right, go ahead, go 40 ahead. seconds now left in this match. Good luck, you guys. Have fun. Again for the Red Alliance. Masquerade with two bids in their possession. We are now in endgame. And off they go. Three bids now for Masquerade, making their way up the ramp and up to the top. I know there's a lift in their future. There they go. 11 seconds, 10 seconds now left in this match. With oh, 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 oh. Red Alliance lifting, losing just one of their bins, but still in possession of two. And that is the end of the match. Good job by both alliances. And there you have it. Red wins at 121 to Blues. Hard earned 30 points. Three, two, one, go. Lemons is the far right, right? Le yeah, the lemons have not moved. They're not moving. This guy is coming in. That looks interesting. All right, if I can keep the action straight versus my teams, we'll be doing a good job down yeah, here with 14 great. seconds they're left in autonomous in. mode. Uh, they lost it, and the second one is pretty interesting, too. They kind of went and stopped right in the middle, halfway. Right. That's interesting. And that's the end of autonomous mode. All right, I got a thumbs up from the referees. Red Alliance, are you ready? Blue Alliance, are you ready? Dave, are you ready? Dave was born ready in three, two, one, go. Okay, looks like we may have a field issue here. All four robots dropping off at the exact same time. Okay, we have our FTAs out here checking it out. Once again, all four robots dropped out at the exact same time. And there we go. We've, we've called the match. We're resetting the robots. 
apparent technical difficulty on field number two. So we're going to reset the robots, and we will reset, and we will rerun match 14. Three, two, one, go! Here we go. WHS Robotics, spinning around in the middle of the floor for the Blue Lions, getting into position to capture a bid, rolling over balls. Let's see if they can get any into their possession as they roll across the field. For the Red Lions, both robots out towards the back side of the field. Looking for some action. Okay, we got an FTA on the field. Working with our Romanian team, as they unfortunately sit idle. Doing some diagnostics. Red, blue lines, 35, 49. Classified has it been on their robot. One of the reds lost the connection. They'll get in a position to lift. Blues are the P4076 for the Red Alliance defense. playing defense. That's Robugs from Georgia. We're in end game already. Got disconnected. Almost got it. Look at that. All right, there they go. There goes classified. Six feet. Got that bin up there. Beautiful job. Nice robot. They're all great bots. Everybody else is kind of Just getting warmed up this morning on our first day of competition. This is the first round of eight for each one of the teams. And that is the end of our game. Match number 15. We're going to go back over to field two for the replay of match 14. All right, while we're waiting, we're taking measurements. Three, two, one, go. Team 118, Steel Hornet down off the ramp for the Red Alliance, as is Team 5009 for the Blue Alliance from our Edmonton Canadian team. Steel Hornet's able to get the red bowling ball into the, the front zone. The red one got it in. And we have a blue robot in the zone at the back of the field. Oh, yeah. Nicely done by the Metcalks. That's the end of autonomous flows. All right, on Edison number two, the referees are taking a score. Referees give a thumbs up, time's on the board. Drivers, grab your controllers. Drivers, grab your controllers. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. All right, 51-78 coming out of that score zone that they were able to achieve in autonomous mode, that's the Mech Hawks. Shooting out onto the field, their alliance partner coming from the opposite direction. Putting the squeeze on Team 118, Steel Hornet. Combustible Lemons now getting into the fray. Everybody's stacked up here. Battling it out for possession of Vince. We have all four robots now. In the back part of the field. One eighteen breaking free. Steel Hornets on the prowl, picking up balls, just sweeping them up off the floor. All right, 5,009 for the Blue Lions. Also now breaking free, moving towards the only stack of bins with ball still on it on the field. So it looks like 118 might be playing D. And then, yeah, if you want to go. I think they're Running into 54, 66 with 30 seconds to go. They're just going Halo. 
We still have all robots battling it out in the back of the field. No apparent scoring yet, except for what we saw originally. 118 steel horn is for the Red Alliance, however. Grabbing onto the bowling ball, trying to get it in their possession so they can move it over to the ramp with four, three, two, one. That is the end of the match. Match 14. Three, two, one, go. Big pile up there. That's interesting. Is there, are there a line? They're pushing a line. Uh, they're pushing the stack into the. I think they're pushing the red stack. Yeah. All right, we have five seconds left in autonomous mode. Three robots now down on the pads. That's a big pile up. All right, referee scoring this one. Again, this is match 17. We'll move over to field number two for match 16 once this is concluded. Running in reverse order, even to odd, odd to even. Drivers, grab your controllers. India, grab your controllers. All right, everything looks good. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Time's on the board. Three, two, one, go. And we've got all four robots in motion. Looking good down here. As this is match 17, we are now in our second rotation. So you're going to be seeing the second match for all of these robots as we move forward on the Edison Field. That's not a, that's not great. No. They're taking space out of the place. 50 points or whatever. Yeah. So 3587, they play Oh, really? yeah. Oh, yeah, for the Red Alliance, both robots now picking up balls. Blue Alliance, we do have one robot, 30. That is not in motion. We do have an FTA over assisting the team. That's Team Captain. They put their controllers down, unfortunately. One minute left in this match now. Oh, really? And that's the one we're aligning with? No. The green we're aligning with all of them. The, the one that's got the plastic. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Got it. Where did they, where did they leave that? Yeah. India's the one that pushed it into the... All right. Battling it out. We do have a stack with balls for the Red Alliance. That is in their zone. Nice scoring on their part. And we're down to 30 seconds in endgame. Team 3587, parallel processing. Now has a bowling ball in their possession, as does 5341, Black Frog Robotics for the Blue Lions. They have very similar mechanism for grabbing these balls and getting them up the ramp with seven seconds now left in autonomous mode. Oh, Lions partner for the Red Alliance, trying to get him and push him and help him up the ramp. They both do now have successfully Put balls onto the ramp, although not nested, still worthy of points. Nice job by both alliances in our end game 30 seconds. Match 17, Red Alliance wins with a score of 51 to 35. Three, two, one, go! Wow, all four of these robots are about as big as you can get. I'll bet you that in mechanical inspection, they were right on the edge, but they all apparently have passed without an issue. A lot of noise coming down there from 3531 right now, short circuit. 
Right, that's the end of autonomous. Let's get controllers up in our hands. All right, drivers have the controllers in their hands. We got a thumbs up from the ref, thumbs up from time. Red Alliance, ready. Blue Alliance, ready. Three, two, one, go. And there they go. Okay, we do have a bid and rep by the Red Alliance. And it looks like we now have all four robots down. Field tech guys on the issue, diagnosing the issue. And they've now all reconnected. they decided to call this match. We will replay this match. It looks like we had field technical difficulties. We're going to reset all of the robots as well as the field and replay this match. Three, two, one, go! And there goes the blue crew. Spinning around, knocking balls all over the place. This is team 5687 able to get the blue ball into their zone as there is one red bowling ball in the appropriate red alliance zone. And we have a robot scoring team 975 for the red alliance as well. Good job by Synergy Robotics. They went into the middle, bumped over a bunch of straights, and then came back hard and pushed the bowling ball. We're good? All right, referees, give a thumbs up. Drivers have the controllers. Two minutes on the board. Red Alliance ready. Blue Alliance ready. Three, two, one, go. All right. All right, there they go. Robots in motion. Team 5687, sweeping balls up with a conveyor mechanism. Looks like shelf liner to me. Many of the robots using shelf liner, the rubberized compound. Has just enough stickum to pick these balls up. Oh, that is really sweet. For the blue lines, 5687, lifting one bin up. Possessing a second bin, flipping it over, and also bringing it up. 
into their possession. And dumping, oh, just missing dumping a ball inside for the Blue Lions. Red Alliance 28-87. Trying to push themselves forward to deposit a ball into a bin. 50 seconds now left in this match. They got two plays. Blue team's gonna run away with it. Yeah, this is match number 19. Synergy Robotics for the Red Alliance. Spinning around in the center of the field. 30 seconds now left in autonomous mode. Team 135 up on top of their ramp and they're starting their lift. Go Fusion, there they go, up and up and up. And we're coming down on 10 seconds now left in this match and there we are. We have one lift for the Blue Alliance, a ball being lifted by the another by the opposed wow. the other Alliance, and we got one second left. Yeah, and both Blue left. Alliance oh. robots have now lifted. However, we're losing it oh. with 5687. Oh. Robots collapsing back on themselves. Great match, Regard. And congratulations, guys. They're doing a great job so far today as we go through our second round. Match 19, Blue Alliance wins with a score of 149 to 61. Three, two, one, go. Oh, we got the bowling ball. All right, that's the end of autonomous mode, match number 16. Good start by both robots. They're in a good position. They can come and get this. All right, we're going to wait for our referees to score this one. We do have an FTA on the field checking out one robot. Like our referees are ready now. Red Alliance, are you ready? Blue Alliance, are you ready? And three, two, one, go! Oh, and been spilling over. But that was the plan for both the Red Alliance and Blue Alliance. They should have gone way ahead. What the heck? Flipping bins upright. But 37 13, the Cyber Knights already have a bin in their possession. And lifting it higher. Cyber Knights able to take multiple bins in their possession and feed balls into those bins. Beautiful robot, nice mechanism. 35, 31, and 58, 38. One from each alliance. Now battling it out in the middle. What the heck, meanwhile, starts lifting their bin with 55 seconds left in this match. Forty-two seconds left now. What the heck's lifting higher and higher? Coming up on endgame. And 
Joseph for the Blue Lions. Both the Lions partners now in endgame with their bins going as high as they possibly can. Getting dangerous down here with these towers, 37-13, the Cyber Knights also lifting higher. We have 15 seconds left and there they go. Look at the lifts on this field. This is going to be a high scoring match and we still have seven seconds as they stretch as far as they can go. There they go, 37-17. Go Cyber Knights. Wow, what a great match. Look at the crane towers we have down here. For match number 16, look at this score in match number 16. Blue Alliance score 400, Red Alliance 545 points. That's 945 compiled points. And qualification match 16, 545. Now our high score of the day. Three, two, one, go. Am I doing this one or? You got it. Check one, two, check one, two. Check one, two, check one, two. Can you, can you guys Turn it on, go, you go. All right, I'm on. We got robots running in autonomous mode, 13 seconds left. Looks like at the end of a toss mode, we have one blue robot in the back and their blue bowling ball is in the front. Referees are still calculating the final score of autonomous mode. All right, looks like we're ready to go. Everyone ready, stand behind the line. Count scorekeeper ready. Three, two, one, go. Here we go, teleoperated period. 41.85 immediately coming out. Looks like they are, they were gonna go for those red bowling balls, or red balls at this side of the turn around, going for a red crate. Meanwhile, 40.81 picking up a blue crate. FTC equals mess. Fast times fun going up, pushing around a big bunch of crates. Not sure where they're trying to bring them. One minute, 20 seconds left in this match. Forty-one eighty-five. the Silver Soldiers picking up a blue ball, trying to get it inside of their crate. 35-67, scoring two points, putting a blue ball, put a ball inside the blue crate, there's one minute remaining. 41-85, starting to lift up their crates, as is 35-67. 35-67, fear the gear, blue alliance, they have their arm held up really high. They just need to start bringing that crate up, it has one ball inside of it. Forty-one eighty-five, holding two crates in their possession, each with a ball in it. We are in the end game. Less than 30 seconds left. Fifty-seven eighty-four, FTC mass to the fun. Push around the red bowling ball. Not seem to have much effect on it. Ten seconds remaining. Forty-one eighty-five, going up on the ramp. They're up there. An extra ten points. Three. Two, one. Three, two, one, go. Here we go in autonomous mode. We got two robots running. We got three robots running. Unlimited's coming down. Here we go, we got a red bowling ball in that front parking zone as well as team 54, 50, 54, 45, 54 is also parked in that front parking zone.
three, two, one. That concludes the title's period. Yeah, I don't think anybody can beat the ranking points now. 400 ranking points. So the team that lost, do they get 545 ranking points? No. Only teams that win get ranking points. Looks like we're ready to go. Referees are done scoring. Time to keep you ready. Red Alliance Blue has to pick up your controllers. Three, two, one, go. They were actually lucky. They got to get up paired up against us. All three, four robots are moving. 54, 39, picking up a blue crate. Placing it in their robot. Now they're just going to be looking for a racquetball. They have a really high scissor lift. Let's see them use it. Got a big traffic jam in the middle of the field. One minute, 30 seconds left in the match. We have a racquetball inside one of those red crates. Both red robots are able to lift really high. All they got to do is pick up that crate. One minute, 10 seconds. Unlimited, playing some defense over on 54-39. Guys, dyslexic, it's 45-39. 55 seconds left of this match. Forty-two, thirty-eight, just right around the field, picking up ball, after ball, after ball. Forty seconds left. Thirty-five seconds, get ready for your in-game strategies. Looks like we have team 50, 45, 39, the sourdoughs on top of the ramp, lifting up high. Oh my, look at them go. 15 seconds left. Meanwhile, also on the blue lines, 42-38. The Robo Chicken Gator flies up a pile and lift it up high as well. Oh, Eight seconds great. left. Yeah. Not that high. So one. Three, two, one. <laughs> 49, 64. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. There we go at the tunnel spell. We got Highlight Robotics and 2803, the Raptor Robotics, both run around. Highlight Robotics gets the robot and the blue volleyball in the front parking zone. Here it comes, 2803 on the Red Alliance. Raptor Robotics put in the red ball. Oh, is it going to stay? I think that ball is going to stay. We'll let the referees decide. But meanwhile, oh, even in toss mode, they give it an extra little push. Their robot makes it in as well. Meanwhile, Team 4586 parked themselves in the back parking zone. Excellent job, Blue Alliance. That gives us one blue robot in the back parking zone. It gives us both two red ro two robots in the front zone and both bowling balls in that front zone. Looks like we have a crate knocked over on each team. That's an additional five points for both alliances.
All right, timekeeper, you ready? All right, let's get this match underway. Three, two, one, go. We got the robots running. We got Tell Albert up here going. 20, 28, oh, 3, and 30, uh, 354 in a shoving match over near the front parking zone. Twenty-eight oh three, bushing around that stack with all those balls on it. Gotta be careful with that. Don't want to accidentally knock those over. All right, I know it's exciting over there, but we gotta keep rolling. Looks like twenty-eight oh three is grabbing onto those balls. They're trying to reposition them somewhere. They teeter. They're moving around. Oh, the balls go flying everywhere, scattering across the field. One minute, ten seconds left in this match. Three fifty-four is still trying to play a little bit of defense over there on Raptor Robotics. Meanwhile, fifty-four eighty-six, the Tigers grabbing onto a blue crate. There are a couple of balls inside that protected area. Those are going to be worth one point each. Fifty-eight forty-three, Team Vortex running around, also grabbing onto some crates. Here comes 354, pushed around those balls, trying to get to the one point position. However, Auto Vortex is saying, no, we're not going to let you do that. We're going to play a little bit of defense on you. You're not going to get those points. 20 seconds left in this match. No robots are possessing any crates. This might all come down to how many points you have in the one point uh, protected area. Eight seconds left. Three, two, one. Three, two, one, go. So far, we got one red robot moving around in toss period. Oh, 50, 85, moving around on that ramp. Oh, they are coming really close to falling over. 41, 33, Helena Robotics pushing the red bowling ball into the front parking zone. Meanwhile, 4106, the supposable thumbs parking in the back parking zone. Can 4133 make it in? Yes, they made it in there. Get an extra, extra bonus points there for the Red Alliance for parking in that front parking zone. That concludes the end of autonomous period. Meanwhile, there's also one red crate tipped over. Additional five points for the Red Alliance. All right, pick up your controllers. Timekeeper, you ready? Referees, three, two, one, go. Oh, rocket balls go flying all over the field. Big collision in the center. Forty-one, thirty-three, printing over all those one-pointers, scoring them many, many one-pointers over there in the protected area for the Red Alliance. Each one counts as one point. Blue Alliance can still come by, sweep those away, but if those are there at the end of the match, those will be one point each. Fifty eighty-five Newton's lawyers. They place a ball inside of a blue crate and place it on top of their robot, covering it up, protecting it. One minute, 15 seconds left in this match. All right, let's introduce our team here. This gentleman 
41-33 in the protected area, trying to stack, but they got hit by 41-08, 41-06. That is going to be a major penalty on the Blue Alliance. They came into the red protected area and bumped into all those crates. 40 points. 41-33, lifting up. They've got another crate. They are... Might be able to get two crates on their possession here in just a moment. We're coming up on end game. 32, 31, 30 seconds left in this match. Rocking and rolling. We got all sorts of crates on robots. Here it comes 41 33. On top of the ramp. They're lifting up. They're going to get 10 points added to however by they score. Meanwhile, look at 5085 lifting that scissor lift up high, scoring for the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one. Three, two, one, go. I see three robots Thank running. You. Blue, knocked out one of the double blue crates. And there she is. Scattering those racquetballs all over the field. That's 10 points for the blue line. As well as, let's see, we got a blue robot in a blue bowling ball parked in that front parking zone. Excellent job, team 4250. Team Life Saber. Okay, it looks like we're finishing the toss mode. Ready to go, please pick up your controllers. Timekeeper, you ready? Three, two, one, go. Hey, I'm about to know Saiba be Four robots moving to teleoperate, period. There's something wrong with that thing. 58, 44, slowly but surely, coming down on the ramp. They make it down without tipping over. I'd swap out that servo control. 4250, right Oklahoma team knocking over those blue crates, scattering more balls across the field. You got an extra one laying around? I'm sure. I'm sure they do. Because we have lots of them. Over on field number one, we started the match as well. We're running just a little bit behind on this field, so we thought we'd kick it in. That doesn't sound too good. One minute, 15 seconds left in this match. Yeah, if you're not group tossed it. One minute, three seconds left in this match. We have 4466 taking control of a red crate, holding possession of it. They are now looking for a ball to place inside of it. If they do so, they'll be able to lift it up really high during that end game. 50 seconds left in this match. Check out team 5178, the Mechhawks, placing all sorts of balls inside the crate they're holding, starting to lift it up. 35 seconds left in the match. Madcocks decide we're not waiting for the end game. We're going to lift now. Try to stop us. We're going up high. Red Alliance showing an advantage. Many, many points are scored from those Madcocks. High left. But they're not done yet. They're going higher. They're going higher. 10 seconds left. Madcox going up, three, two, one. We're gonna get caught up on the scores here on the Edison Fields, not posted. Qualification match 22, Red Alliance won it with a score of 116 to 239. Three, two, one, go. Here yeah, we go, the Tottenham's mode, all four robots are running. Looks like we got team 40, 4906 parking in the back parking zone. Meanwhile, 2843 putting their bowling ball and their robot in the front parking zone. That was both, that was the blue lines, red lines doing the same thing. One robot, one bowling ball in that front parking zone. That concludes the end of autonomous mode. Pick up your controllers.
Referee say they're ready. Timekeeper is ready. Pick up your controllers. Three, two, one, go. Here we go, tell the operator period. 44, 44, knocking over a bunch of racquetball. As does 49.06. Oh, they got, they got a crate. The other guy's got a crate. Forty-five, uh, twenty something. They got a crate. Forty-five, twenty-nine. Red Alliance picking up a red crate. Uh, those are good. Blue Alliance doing the same thing. They picked up a blue crate. They had a blue ball in it. Blue ball goes flying out. They got to go get it themselves another one. They picked it back up. Can they bring it back in there? They do. That's 44, 44, placing a blue crate on top of their robot. 49.06 has a red crate with a with the ball inside of it. Twenty-eight forty-three under the sun of the Blue Alliance. They have possession of a blue crate. It looks like they've dropped it back on the map, trying to reposition it. 40 seconds left of this match. Hey, Gage, Gage. Does our, does our battery pack have an Anderson? 33 seconds, get ready for the end game. 28, 43, lifting up really high. They are now craning this blue crate up to the top, going up high. Their blue last partner doing the same. Higher and higher and higher. Meanwhile, oh. 45, 29 of the red lights lifting up not one, but two crates high up in the air. Whoa, there goes 44, 44, three, two, one. Oh. Excellent job to both teams. And in match 24, another high scoring match. Blue Lines takes it with a score of 369 to 103. Three. Two, one, go! So far, three robots moving in toss mode. Red quickly going to that back parking zone, securing their points. No, they come out of the back parking zone and they go run into 3509, preventing the Blue Alliance from making their way to that bar back parking zone. That's okay. Meanwhile, 3531 ramming the red bowling ball, pushing into the front parking lot. There has been one red crate turned over. Additional points there for the Red Alliance. That's a great defense. We can actually, we can actually uh, put, a, put a crate on top of the ball. And I've, I've seen you get close. That's a great defense. That's rare that you don't see one ball get to kill. Yeah, I don't remember ever seeing it. That's a great defense. Uh, what number was that? Our partner. They just completely shut them down. Oh, we got the bowling ball in, right? Okay, looks like the referees are ready. Score, or timekeeper, you all ready? Pick up your controllers. All right, three, two, one, go. Got three robots running, 51-32. Made a little move during the Tonsma, but not running now during the teleopera. Man, listen to those 35, 31 short circuits. Johnny Five is definitely alive. I can hear that robot. That would definitely be one of the loudest robots at the competition. Team 54, 24, the Robo Mounties. Playing a little bit of defense over there on 3509. Who's now playing a little bit of defense over there on the short circuits? 
One minute, 15 seconds left in this match. Short circuits have two crates on top of their robots. One of them is just kind of teetering, barely staying on top. Team 54-54 knocking over double red crate, putting a whole lot of one-pointers in for the Blue Alliance. So that's the Red Alliance scoring many, many points there for Blue. That could be strategy. 45 seconds left in this match. Can the short circuits get a third crate on top of their robot? We'll see. It's up there. How high can they now lift them? 30 seconds left. They're going up on top of the ramp. No matter how many points they score, they just got an additional 10 points for each one of them. Here they go. Let's going go, up go. high. Going up oh, high. 15 man. seconds. Look at them go. Let's go. Boom shakalaka. Oh. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Woo! Is that all you got? <laughs> Let me get the fourth one. <laughs> With our high score of the day, Red Alliance 601, Blue Alliance 22. That is the highest score of our world championship tournament today. Take that, Franklin Field. Three, two, one, go! We have some sharp dressed men out here today. Uh, Team Alliances dressed all in black. Here come the men in black. 20 seconds left over the time of this period. But they brought the blue, blue stack. Yep. All right, everybody, do a little dance. That red one. That concludes autonomous period. All right, looks like we are good to go. No scores for autonomous period. Time keeper, you all ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, pick up your controllers, guys. Thirty-five, forty-nine. Got red and blue flash the lights. Looks like they're going to go over there. Pull over the blue alliance. Woo. One minute, 45 seconds left in this match. I'd love to tell you what Team Classified's doing, but I just don't have the clearance to do so. <laughs> one minute, 22 seconds left in this match. You guys are two against one. <laughs> Team 5009 looks like they're having a little bit of trouble. Hopefully they can get that worked out by the end of this match. FTA is checking out that robot. Meanwhile, though, we got lots of defense being played. We got robots trying to pick up balls, pushing crates around the field. Less than a minute left of this match. I'll be back in like two hours. Team just good minute business going over, giving their Alliance partners little tap. Come on, come back alive. So far, the only score is a one pointer that I see over here on the red Alliance protected area. 30 seconds left. Forty, sixty-four, run right around. Looks like fifty oh nine actually is running. They're lifting up their arm. They have no crate though. Here it comes forty sixty-four. Looks like they're coming over to the red protected zone. They might be trying to clear out that one pointer ball. Who knows? Or they're going for the bowling ball. Like a boss. Score for match twenty-six. Red Alliance wins with a score of 16 to 5. Three, two, one, go! 47, 47, trying to come down the ramp. They got themselves stuck on the bump there. 49, 97, masquerade. Slowly, meticulously pushing over those 
those balls. I often see them back up and push the bowling ball. Let's see if they still do it. Five seconds left. Looks like that concludes Tom's period. No scores in the Thomas period. Scorekeeper, are you ready? Guys, pick up your controllers. Scorekeepers are ready. Referees are ready. Three, two, one, go. We got all four robots running. However, 47-47 is stuck on their home ramp. They get themselves free. They're coming down the ramp. Thirty-nine, fifty-one, going for a blue crate. They have possession of it. They're now looking for a racquetball. Stick inside. Forty-seven, forty-seven. Tank drive robot. The tank treads broke off. They're now driving around without them. Masquerade in control of a crate. Couple of balls inside of that crate. Less than a minute remaining. Give you a little bit of history over here on Masquerade. They have won every single event they have gone to. Forty seconds left. Thirty-nine, fifty-one. The cyborgs. Placing a racquetball inside one of their crates. They now hold two crates, each with a ball inside of it. They're deciding they're going to lift up high. 30 seconds left. Looks like they've only lifted up about 50% as high as it can go. Masquerade also lift up high on the Red Alliance. We have a Red Alliance robot with two crates lifting up high. We have a Blue Alliance. Oh, no. Masquerade. Oh, no. Oh, it hurts. It hurts. Looks like the only crate still up in the air is from Masquerade. Five seconds left. All robots are done. One second. Oh, the robotality of it all. Three, two, one, go. So, 58-52 is from a city called Duran Duran. I think I've heard of an artist that named that before, too. Excellent group. Okay, autonomous mode. Looks like we have Red Alliance parked in the front parking lot. No crates turned over. Ooh, looks like over there on the Blue Alliance side, Robot is not in the back parking lot. However, their arm is. Referees are going to count that, but that is breaking the plane. That should count for five points for the Blue Alliance. 542 putting themselves in a pretty awkward condition. Don't know how the heck they got two of their wheels lifted off the ground like that. Well done, fellas. Referee, say they're ready. Time, keep you guys ready. Pick up your controllers. All right, three, two, one, go. Big traffic jam in the middle of the field. All the crates, all the robots, all right there together.
542 on the runner lines playing a little bit defense over there on 3141. Stop, bears, 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 stop, bears. One minute 30 seconds left of this match. Twenty-eight, seventy-nine. The Thunderbots pushing around the Omni Wheel Bot over there at the Bears. Seconds left. Red robot and blue robot over there in the corner. It's just kind of doing a little dim jimmy. 30 seconds left. So far, the only scores I see in this match are two balls over there in the blue protected area. One point each. Six seconds left. Three, two, one. Three, two, one, go. Here we go in the autonomous mode. We have one robot already in the back parking zone. Here it comes, 43, 11, and 58, 31. Both pushing bowling balls. Both bowling balls made it in the front parking lot. However, it looks like only one Blue Alliance made it in. 28, 45 says the show's not over yet. We're gonna go get an extra five points for the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one. All right, once again, this is our final match on field number one in our Edison division, as in Franklin division. Teams, the teams for matches 30 and 30, or excuse me, 31 and 32 will be queued up early at 1245, as will 33 and 34 to come up onto the field because we're going to start our matches this afternoon promptly at one o'clock in the afternoon, one o'clock. So we hope everybody has a great lunch, a nutritious lunch. Get your onion bitch back up because when we come back this afternoon, you're gonna need it. We're gonna see some more amazing robotics. Pick up your controllers. All right, referees are ready. Timekeepers are ready. All right, three, two, one, go. There we go with the last teleoperated period before lunch. Racquetballs go flying all over the field. Forty-three, eleven, going for a blue crate, as is 28-45. Whoa, looks like 48-56 playing a little bit of defense over there on team duct tape. One minute, 20 seconds left in this match. 58-31 going for a red crate. That red crate they're going for already has a racquetball inside of it. One minute, 10 seconds left of this match. Looks like 48-56 is might be stuck on a ball. They're not moving. Well, less than a minute left of this match. 43-11, holding a crate. That crate has a ball in it. They have a sizzle lift when it comes. 
disqualification match 30, ready to post the scores. Blue Lions, wow, score of 242. Red Lions, 135. The Blue Lions wins match 30.